hi welcome to TrueTuber in this video I will show you how to calculate mean standard deviation and variance in Excel this is Excel 2013 now let us start with the video uh, here you can see uh, the following table uh, here it is written uh, observation number it is observation it is X this x minus mean that is the how much the observation is deviated from the mean it is x deviation is devi deviation square in the uh, bottom you can see that there is sum count the how many observation and there is mean let us start now you all know about the formula of summation just select this and drag enter you get the sum now for count put the co formula count mm, and drag it so you get that uh, the observation num number is same as the count so it's fine what is mean mean is the total summation by the observation number that is the count so equal to sum by count please please press enter 77.4 okay now what is x minus mean x x minus mean so if you put enter and drag the formula from this cell to the below cells the next here the next formula will be b6 minus b18 so you don't want to uh, minus this cell you want to minus this cell only so you have to fix the b17 cell so there is a function called dollar function if you write down dollar b dollar 17 that will fix the cell there is a shortcut for dollar function that is f4 click press f4 you see all uh, the b17 is changed to dollar b dollar 17 now press enter now drag this file drag this cell up to this level hmm. so you see the next uh, next formula that that is b17 is fixed you have to square this shift 6 yes, you will get this symbol so enter. and now you drag this this is the sum of this total if you uh, if you want to sum of this total so you can drag this file you get the uh, sum uh, account you can drag now what is the variance the variance is the variance is equal to this x minus mean square by count minus 1 it is the formula of variance now put now press enter you get the variance now what is the standard deviation standard deviation is the square root of variance so s q r t this or you can write down this way also equal to this power to the power 0.5 you get the same result so this is all you get the variance standard deviation as well as mean here it's a very simple video hope I think you like uh, this video if you like this video please subscribe me and like my video Thank you. True to you.